Okay, so let's solve this one, binomial expansion. So using this binomial theorem formula, now, from this given, so 2x plus 3y to the power 4, so to expand this binomial equation using this formula, so f now on the given, that's 2x, and s, that's the second term, that's 3y, and n, that's the exponent, that's 4. Then since r starts from 0, so for our first term, r equals 0. Then substitute now these values to this formula. So n is 4, choose r, so 4, choose 0, because r is equal to 0, and n equals 4. Then f, that's the first term, we have 2x to the power n minus r, so 4 minus 0. Then times s, s is 3y to the power r, so r is 0. Then simplify this one, so 4 choose 0, that's 1. Then this one, 4 minus 0, that's 4. Then distribute 4, so this becomes 2 to the power 4 and x to the power 4. And this 3y to the power 0, since uh, any number raised to 0 is always equal to 1. Then simplify. So that's 1 times 1, that's uh, 1. Then this 2 to the power 4, that's 16, x to the power 4. Then multiply. So the first term now is 16, x to the power 4. Then for the second term, so r now equals 1. So we have 4 choose 1, then 2x to the power 4 minus 1, and 3y to the power 1, because r now is equal to 1. Then simplify, so this 4 choose 1, that's 4. Then this 4 minus 1 is uh, 3, then distribute 3, so that becomes 2 to the power 3 and x to the power 3. Then this 3y to the power 1, that's 3y. Then multiply this 4 times 3y, that's 12y. And this 2 to the power 3, that's 8x to the power 3. Then multiply 12 and 8, that's 96x to the power 3 times y. So this is the second term. Then for the third term, r now equals 2. So we have now 4 choose 2 because r now is 2. Then f, that's 2x to the power 4 minus 2. And this 3y to the power 2. Then simplify this 4 choose 2 using, your, uh, using calculator. That's 6. Then this 4 Minus 2, that's 2. Then distribute. So we have 2 squared and x squared. Then this 2 distribute to 3 and y. So that's 3 squared and y squared. Then simplify. We have 6 times 2 squared. That's 4x squared. And 3 squared, that's 9y squared. Then multiply 6 times 4, that's 24 times 9, that's 216, x squared and y squared. So this is the third term. Then for the fourth term, r equals 3. So we have 4 choose 3, then 2x, 4 minus 3, times 3y to the power 3. Then simplify this 4 choose 3, that's uh, 4. Then this 4 minus 3, that's 1. So 2x to the power 1, or just 2x, then distribute this 3. So we have 3 to the power 3 and y to the power 3. Then simplify, so 4 times 2, that's 8x, and this 3 to the power 3, that's 27y to the power 3. Then multiply 8 and 27, so that's 216xy to the power 3. And the last term, that's the fifth term, r equals 4. This one is the last term because 
r now is equal to n and n that's 4. So we have 4 choose 4, then 2x to the power 4 minus 4 times 3y to the power 4. Then simplify, so this 4 choose 4, that's 1, and this 4 minus 4 is 0. So 2x to the power 0, so any number raised to 0 is 1. Then this 4 distributes, so we have 3 to the power 4 and y to the power 4. Then this 1 times 1 is 1, and 3 to the power 4, that's 81 y to the power 4. Then multiply, so the last term now, or the fifth term, is 81 y to the power 4. So this binomial equation now is equal to 16x to the power 4 plus 96x to the power 3y plus 216x squared y squared plus 216xy to the power 3 plus 81y to the power 4. Now take note, all positive because the given is positive.